guys on today's vlogs we will carry out a uh, main engine fuel pumps overhauling for cylinder number one to six so let's begin so this engine is 6s fdmc six cylinder 10600 brake force power at 116 rpm so ito yung Template ng Alright guys, so we have uh, six pieces plunger and barrel of fuel pump. So ito yung plunger and barrel niya, no? unlike the other uh, diesel engine, this one is very big. Siyempre malaking makina, kaya yeah, malaki yung fuel pump. So ito plunger and barrel, ito yung Uh, pinaka main component ng fuel pump ito yung nagbobomba ng fuel to the engine so ipapump niya yan ito ipapump niya yan yan, gaya ng movement yan and then i-deliver niya sa injector valves then papunta sa main engine so magpaparit kami lang ang napirasong plunger and parit yan pieces plunger and barrel oh. malaki pa yan sa braso ko kamay ko so we have this uh, special tools this one for lifting the plunger and barrel this one is for measuring the pump lift ito yun okay. so and then for fuel rack para mahila yung fuel ramp BIT ako sa yung mga spanner ito ba kagabi fork wrench fork wrench mahaba so ito yung mga kailangan kailangan na natin pagka nag overhaul tayo lang fuel pump yan so first of all we will engage the turning gear So we are now taking out the pump rack. So guys, as you can see, we are now putting out the uh, oil oil pump tap holder together with the uh, suction valve, and we are now securing it. So this one is the suction valve. So now we are inserting and uh, tightening these uh, special tools. We use this to pull out the plunger and barrel from the engine. So make it sure that the fuel rack and VIP is free so we can put out the plunger and barrel. So guys, can we add it to wait? So we need to disengage the gear from the fuel rack and VIP. So after that, we can now take out the plunger and barrel. 
using the uh, chain down to dismount the dual pump plug gel and pallet. So ito guys, napakarumi yun. Kung makapansin nyo, dun sa ilalim niya, pinakababa, yan. Yan, makasok yung plunger mo, yung, yung bike room na yun. Sasagat siya, dun sa, hanggang dun sa pinakababa ng camshaft. So, itong, itong may ito na to, so, dito naman nakakabit yung barrel mo, no? Once na, na-push tong rack, yan, magbibigay siya ng more fuel, no? Yan, magbibigay siya ng more fuel sa engine. Guys. We put the uh, Vaseline oil from surroundings of fuel pumps and lager and barrels. Now we are uh, setting it back to the engine with the new spare plunger and barrels. Of course with the uh, new seal rigs and uh, Vaseline, uh, Vaseline oil for lubrication. So make it sure that this guy is coincide with the bolts uh, that one. Dahan, dahan natin siya ng baba para tayo magkaroon ng problema. Guys, we need to hammer uh, this uh, fuel rack. So the gear from the rack and the uh, barrel is all inside. And we can uh, move really the plunger and the barrel. Now the uh, fuel rack and the barrel is coincide and so we will uh, take out these uh, special tools from the plunger and barrels. So well done. Pag-alagyan natin ang lamis dito sa ilalim. Yan. Ibig sabihin, uh, dito itong pan mo, yung seat sa loob. So, yan. So, lahat to, ilagyan natin ng uh, oil. And then, uh, naantay na lang natin k
Kaya nang isapang kung mag- para malaman natin yung uh, efficiency ng mga po natin na uh, pakinan na rin. Right? So guys, may may suction valve. No? Palitan na ng bago. Yung spare suction valve installed in the fuel pump top, co- top cover. There you go. We will uh, set it back to the engine later. Now we are uh, putting a uh, Vaseline oil to the uh, suction valve. So guys, uh, as you can see, we are now setting it back to the fuel pump up cover together with the new spare suction valve in the fuel pumps. So make it sure na the pump is not done, but it's not done. I only pray you never leave me behind Never leave me Because good music can be so hard to find So hard to find I 